Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're unboxing a buttload of Target stuff. I got a few exclusives here and they had a little special going. I think buy two get one free. So let's see what I got. I got five boxes and a little bag. Why don't we start with the bag? This is our first box. We got five more to go right after this one. So off the bat, this is the only pop I got today that I didn't really care for. So reason for that is they were running a buy two get one free. So I, the only thing I, I could go with was I might as well go with a Target exclusive because later on they'll be really hard to find. And I didn't find that many that I was interested in. So I went with the Joker. There was the bronze Joker and the silver um, looking Joker, but I think I like this one better. So I went with this one. And also, I I was just trying to take advantage of that buy two get one free. So I couldn't just not get anything. And I pretty much already have all the comments. So this was, I ordered this a little while ago but I hadn't opened it. So we got the bad girl. She's kind of like a little loose in the packaging, but we got the bad girl um, breast cancer awareness, which was a Target exclusive as you can see. So that's another good one right there. The box of the Joker is 100% mint. The bad girl doesn't have a thing or anything, but it's just not, you know, not as perfect as it could be and then she's a little loose in there for some reason by the way with this bad girl i uh, i have now five out of the six for the full set i'm missing the joker which is going on for a crazy amount which i'm not trying to pay because the joker was the comic con the new york city comic con one so here we have speaking of the devil we have the Joker. This is the, oh, the box is a little banged up on that one. Tell me this one is good. Tell me this one is good. And there you go, guys. That's why I always try to get two of each. When it's, I'm not gonna say every time I buy an exclusive, but something very limited that might be hard to find later on. Not, not every time, but most of the time I try to get two, just in case something happens in the delivery process. So this one is 100% mint. Oh, okay, you know I take that back. There's a tiny little, a tiny little thing in here, a little ding. But we now have two jokers, technically three. So this one is a little, this is the one that I noticed was damaged right away. There is a little, little ding right here. I don't know if you can see it. Also, this is the set for the holidays. I'm only out of these. I am only missing Harley Quinn with her little hyena pet. Definitely need to get that before Christmas because I want to show them off all together. So, so far we got three Jokers, technically two and a repeat. And we got the Bad Girl. So, a lot of DC action going on today. Target gets a lot of DC exclusives now that I'm thinking about it. Just as Walgreens gets a lot of. Spider-Man related exclusives So they got a little thing going on there And okay, so this one was another one of those That I was like the box is mint. I honestly just held this upside down literally held the box upside down because this is actually How it goes. I don't know if you guys can see it But this is actually how it goes. So I was holding it like this for a second because I forgot they got them upside down. So these are the Duffer Brothers. I believe they created the show Stranger Things on Netflix. I'm not 100% on that. This is literally my first Stranger Things Funko. Because I do plan on collecting. I'm not going to say I'm going to get every single one of them. But it is my second most favorite show on Netflix at the moment. So I do want at least get the whole set. I like the Stranger Things 3 um, Funko release for season 3. So I will be buying a few. This is officially my first one or my first double, my first two pack. Reason for that is 
It was another Target exclusive, again, buy two get one free. I qualify this one as my free one because I bought I bought like three different times the buy two get one free. So one of those sets was this actually isn't included. It was these two guys over here and some other pop that should be in here. And then this one I bought it with another two pack, and I also got a really nice one I just remember, which should also be in here. All right, this is the second to biggest box I had here. So basically almost open. I had these for a while, so I was just saving them to make a one target video. And this is the one I was just talking about. I'm surprised myself I hadn't bought this already. And these big boys, you're better off buying them in store. Mine came a little banged up as you can see. I'm sorry for moving so much, but if you could see there is a little well up here in the front mainly there's some damage here there's also some damage down here and there's a lot of damage up here and here also down here but I don't care cuz I might just display this out of box later on but if you didn't know which I'm sure you didn't cuz you don't know me Back to the Future is my favorite trilogy out of all times. I honestly can't believe I hadn't bought this set yet. I can't believe I hadn't bought it. But I needed to get my hands on it. At the moment, I'm working on building up the whole set. I'm trying to collect all of them from Back to the Future, Back to the Future 2, Back to the Future 3. Which they don't have much of Back to the Future. Back to the Future 3. Because the movie wasn't that successful to me it was my least favorite out of the three but here we have Duck with helmet uh, we got Biff Tannen we got a few Marty's we got four Marty's I have all of these except Marty 1955 and Doc 2015 so I got four out of six and now I got this set over here I would love to get my hands on the DeLorean I think it's a DeLorean with Doc or is it with Marty? I know they have the DeLorean with Einstein on the Dorbs, but I'm not a fan of Dorbs, so I probably won't be getting any Dorbs. And lastly, we got this big boy over here. Let's see what we have in this one. I should have some snacks here, cause to save up, I was like, I was like $10 away from free shipping, and I love my free shipping. And, I decided to get some snacks to go with. So, got some snacks. Got some nice snacks, which are not Funko related. Also, I just noticed my order isn't complete yet. Because I'm missing, I'm missing another Target exclusive. Which I'm not going to go ahead and ruin it by telling you what it is. You're just going to see it in a future video. So, why don't we get to the unboxing so you can get a closer look. Alright guys, so let's unbox them and get a closer look at them, right? Alright guys, so I will not be unboxing the Duffer Brothers today because I feel like it will be more special if I get a few of them. Hopefully at least one full set out of the three and I unbox them together. So just because I don't feel this will be so special, I'm going to go ahead and pull them to the side for a future video. Same goes with Breast Girl, um, Bad Girl. I just want to unbox it together with the set. I'm not sure I'll be getting the Joker, like I've said before, because I'm not trying to overpay for that. But why don't we unbox these few over here? All right, guys, so I have some disappointing news. This is the, the clock tower. I'm sorry. I'm just disappointed. I don't know if you could see this, but it is broken. It's missing one of those pieces up here. And then also, oh, it's bent too. Come on. This is like one of my favorites right here. This is crazy. Look at the detail. That is great. But yeah, 
if you see, get a closer look, the lightning is actually not attached because it came off. What I don't get is, oh, this is the top. Oh no. This is crazy. So this is how it's supposed to look. This is the little top piece. And then this is broken off, as you can see. That's crazy. Uh, that gets me a little sad inside, but. Nonetheless, I guess I can glue it together. It'll never be the same again. This little light bulb is a little, this light pole is a little bent. Um, we got Dr. Brown over here with a little cut. I think this was, well, this was definitely from the first and second. But I believe, to be more exact, it was from the second one. All right, there we got Dr. Emmett Brown. Out of the set I got today from Target, my least favorite, I wanna say, is this Chrome Joker. It is so cheaply built. This is just completely hollow plastic. This is like, I feel like I didn't get my money's worth. Mind you, I got by to get one free. So since this is my least favorite, I would say I got this for free. And I'm telling you, I didn't get my money's worth, which is crazy. But also my most favorite due to the amount of damage that was in this one. You know what? They probably broke in shipping because the box, as I showed you before, is really damaged. Really damaged. So I want to go ahead and say that this joker is pretty good very detailed very nice looking there was a good this is a good jack frost joker i don't know who came up with this idea but boy is this great is this is this a great funko and is this a great christmas pop it sure is it might just be my dc favorite character from the holidays um line it might just be so I think at the moment I would say it's between this one and Scrooge Batman. But I think this one takes the cake. I love all the details. The little icing. Uh, the little popsicle coming down his hand. His little top hat. And the Joker just looks great. It looks amazing. In the other hand, this Joker I honestly feel like it should have never been made never been made not sure that the bronze would have been any better but I definitely don't like that silver I'm not a big fan of chrome pops but this is definitely not not worth anything in my book this is disgusting Dr. Emma Brown definitely seen better days with this set uh, I'll try to put it together though later on try to put it together Alright guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking around Don't forget to subscribe because there's so much more to come in this channel a lot of Funko related stuff um, I should be opening some Funko sodas on the next few videos Trying to split it into maybe two because I got so much more and I got more coming um, I'm also trying to make a video with the holiday set of DC and I want to complete my little back to the future and it's only getting started so guys don't forget to leave a like if you like the video leave a comment letting me know if you gotten any damage packages from Target lately or ever I think this is my very first bad experience with the delivery service very first and in one of the worst cases it could have happened. So yeah. See you on the next one.